When you wish upon a star. Hi guys, it's Megan. Um, I haven't done a vlog in about a month or so. Maybe two months, I don't know. But um, I decided to do one on my pin collection. Um, I got this idea from Letitia. Um, so, here it goes. Um, let's see. I've got about maybe 30 Disney pins and some other pins, but um, here is a, here's where my favorites are. I put it on this lanyard. I kind of took Letitia's idea, so anyway, I got a bunch of pins on Mickey and Minnie. Here's one with Tigger, one with all the parks. Um, here's one with Bambi. Dumbo. One two thousand eight I got it at Hong Kong. Uh Mickey again. Old Disney World. Uh Disneyland. Uh oh, oh my pins fell off. Anyway. Um Mini Tinkerbell. Um here's Pooh and the Gang. Magic Kingdom, two thousand six at Disney World. Uh, Disneyland 50th anniversary. Definitely not trading this one. Is yeah. Um, Walt Disney World 1971. Here's one with MGM. I like this one too. Even though it's not MGM anymore, it's Disney's Hollywood Studios. Um, I have one with uh, Parrot, uh, Mickey, and. I have another one here somewhere. I don't know why these just fell off, but um, here's one with pen trading, the official pen trading pin from Disneyland. Um, and I have a few that I'm willing to, you know, start trading. Um, so if you are interested, um, I guess we could start trading and stuff. So. Um, Here's one with Mickey, Tinkerbell, Mickey again with the United States flag, uh, Pirates of the Caribbean. This one kind of has some paint coming off, but it's pretty good. Um, and here's one with the Rock and Roller Coaster. And I also got some Universal pins and uh, Rainforest Cafe and one from the Disney Experience Store. I mean, NBC experience store, excuse me. Um, I also got some some hard rock pens, some Planet Hollywood ones, House of Blues, you know, from various locations like Hong Kong, Anaheim, New York, and Orlando. So, um, so, yep, that's my pen collection, and... I'm willing to start trading with anyone. If you're into pen trading, let me know. Not much has been going on, really. Um, I didn't hear back from anybody from the jobs I applied, so I've pretty much given up on that since, you know, I check in in 36 days. I go down in 33 days, August 20th. We've been having a bunch of Skype chats, um, August people. Um, so if you wanna if you wanna add me, I'll put my username down there somewhere. Um, yeah, basically a lot a lot of people have been participating, so it's all good. We're starting to get to know each other a little bit. Um, if you wanna add me on Facebook, you can you can do that too. Um, I'll post my link at the bottom as well. Just let me know you're from the DCP, so that way I don't ignore you or anything. My role hasn't disappeared from the DCP website, so I don't think I'm, yeah, I, I'm, I think I'm just going to wait until I go down there and find out, because I don't want to take the chance of being turned away at casting, so yeah, I also heard that if you know beforehand, they might turn away turn you away at casting because 
whatever information is on the hub is confidential. So I don't know if you already know your role or where you're working. Just I don't know. Act act surprised, I guess. Um, so yeah, if you have any other questions or anything I can answer, just let me know on Facebook or you know this YouTube video. Just comment below or hit me up on Twitter. I put my Twitter username and stuff in the info box. So, all right, bye.